there's a great quote from Teddy White's making of the president in which a woman is interviewed in, um, in West Virginia, and she said, you know, we, we shouldn't have a Catholic president. If they wanted us to have a Catholic president, they would have written it in the Constitution. <laughs> so uh, so uh, that's what he was up against. But he now has to fight it out in West Virginia, which he thought he wouldn't have to do. And the polling suddenly comes down to basically being neck and neck with Humphrey. And they do, the Kennedy team surveys all the county chairs, all the Democratic county chairs, and they say, well, what happened? And they said, well, they discovered he's a Catholic. So the amazing thing that he does, and this is where, where you really see action in a campaign. Often campaigns don't have anything to do with the way presidents actually behave in office. But in this case, Kennedy, at first he tries to dodge the, the Catholic issue. He says what everybody here has probably heard or read this, his essential line, which was, when I fought for my country and when I took the oath of office, I didn't think about my religion. I thought about the Constitution. And he does that for a little while, and he realizes it's not working. So then he basically, he, what he did was he would say that and then move on to talk about something else. He then just grabs the issue and decides, okay, I'm going to own it and I'm going to talk about this out loud. He ran ads about this. They had these town halls in which they basically filmed people standing up and asking him whether he would be uh, ruled by the Pope. Um, and, uh, and then he would give his answer and he basically just owned it. And the other thing he did was he spent every waking hour shaking hands, going to the mine opening uh, you know, at uh, five in the morning, and then at the closing when the guys came lifted out of the mine, grimy faces before they went to the shower, he would shake hands with them. That was all captured, and they ran these very powerful ads of him with the miners in West Virginia. And